most of the newly appointed ministers have started attending their offices. Almost all of the new ministers, excepting for Home Minister Mohyuddin Khan Alamgir, went to their respective offices this morning. Alamgir waits a handover of duty from his predecessor, Shahara Khatun, who is currently abroad. The new ministers talked tough against corruption and irregularities. Mujibul Haq has been made the new railways minister. He is the fourth railways minister of the current government. He thinks that maintaining train schedules and battling corruption in the railways are the main challenges for him. He also warned the railway staffs against corruption. I request the railway staff to work hard. There will be no mercy for any negligence in duty and for any corruption. We will never allow them to go unpunished. Hassan ul Haq Inu replaces Abul Kalam Azad as the information minister. On his first day at office, Inu urged journalists to be cautious in publishing news reports. I have started with a challenge to deal with yellow journalism, which completely or partially hides the truth and sometimes distorts the real information. Abul Hassan Mahmud Ali served in Bangladeshi diplomatic missions in different countries for a long time. He now has been chosen to oversee the relief and disaster management ministry. He asked the ministry staff to work with more sincerity. We should work together to take this ministry to a new height. We have a lot more to do. The ministry staff are doing well, but they have scopes to do even better. Mohyuddin Khan Alamgir has been assigned to the Home Ministry. He did not come to the Secretariat today. Instead, he talked to journalists at his residence. We all work under the guidance of the Prime Minister. We have to work to implement our election manifesto. And there is no scope for personal likings or dislikings. Labour Minister Rajuddin Ahmed Raju and State Minister for Industries Omar Farooq Chaudhry did not also come to their offices today.